Flights is amazing and it's definitely the best way to plan your trip and to book cheap flights, but it doesn't do everything. In this video, I'm gonna share three indispensable flight apps and websites that give you more info so you can make better decisions and ultimately have a better travel experience from booking to boarding. Okay, I've mentioned this a bunch of times in other videos, but you can sometimes save hundreds or even thousands of dollars on flights simply by searching alternative flight routes. I don't know about you, but I don't have all those routes memorized. Enter Flight Connections. Flight Connections is a website that shows all flight routes worldwide. Yes, all of them. And is a search engine that shows all flights going to or from any airport. That's what makes Flight Connections so clutch. With its interactive map, you can easily visualize the different routes and connections between different airports, which can help you plan your travel more efficiently. This can be especially helpful if you're trying to find the most direct or nonstop path to your destination. Let me show you two simple ways to use it, as well as some additional features. You can plug in a destination airport, and that will show you all the different ways to get there. Or you can pop a city or an airport into the from box to see all the places that you could go. This gives you much more data than Google Flights, or at least it doesn't pre-filter the data for you based on what it has decided is best. Now the default within a search is to show you non-stop, but you can also toggle it to show multiple stops. Additionally, the legend shows you how major an airport is, with blue being airports with more than 30 connections, yellow having between seven and 30, and red being fewer than seven connections. You can click into any route and see what airlines fly it, on what days, and even if the routes are seasonal. If you opt for the paid version of Flight Connections, you could filter by alliances, airlines, classes, and dates. You could show a price view of the map, get a mobile app, and even get rid of those pesky ads. I love Flight Connections, and I tend to use it when I'm trying to get creative and find a cheaper way to get to my destination, or when I want to find the most direct and nonstop route so I can book a business class seat. Speaking of seats, this next tool helps you make sure that you're not dropping all your hard-earned money or points on the worst seat on the plane. Seat Guru is a website that provides detailed info on airline seats and in-flight amenities. In short, the site aggregates data that allows you to see seating configurations for your flight and read seat level reviews from other travelers so you can make more informed decisions. Decisions that you otherwise wouldn't know until you're getting onto the flight. Things like, in this seat, you don't actually have a window. In this seat, it doesn't recline all the way. To, in this seat, you actually have extra leg room. This is a crucial step of the planning process for me, especially when I'm booking premium economy or business class. It's just not worth it to have a less than ideal seat experience. Here's a quick walkthrough of how to use Seat Guru. Punch in an airline, a date, and a flight number, and you'll get a result. You could also browse by airline and aircraft type. However you get there, you'll be shown a seat map and you'll notice that each seat is one of several different colors. The simple explanation is that green seats are good, red seats are bad, yellow seats have some kind of caveat, and white seats are just standard. And you can hover over any seat to get more detail. You'll also get an overview of any in-flight amenities, as well as see user submitted photos and reviews. Think of it as Amazon product reviews for the airplane seat that you're about to buy. I use Seat Guru all the time and it's helped me avoid those seats that would have been really uncomfortable. And it's also helped me book the best seat in Singapore's business class for a 12 hour flight from Singapore to Istanbul. It was honestly pretty awesome. I mean, for a 12 hour flight, the other seats in business class had it to where you kind of slept at an angle, but the ones we chose, 19A and D, allowed Ali and I to basically sleep straight forward because they had some extra leg room. Seat Guru for the win. Last but not least is FlightAware. FlightAware is a website and app that allows you to track flights in real time and provides detailed info on commercial flights. It's the world's largest flight tracking and data platform. This is really useful if you wanna track the arrival or departure of a particular flight, or if you just wanna track the status of your own flight. Simply put in the flight number to get useful info about any flight. This is great for the family member who's at home worried about you or for the person who's supposed to come pick you up from the airport. Whether you're delayed, made it perfectly on time, or you're there safe and sound, but you don't have internet yet to connect to your phone and contact people, this is the perfect way for other people to see that your flight made it and where you are. 
It's also the perfect way to see where your plane is if it's delayed. One of my favorite things to do is to look at the plane that I will be flying on and see where it is currently. If you're a super nerd like me, you can even back that up to see where else it's been. There is so much data driving flight aware. Another cool way to use it is you can look at the airport level and see the percentage of flights that are on time versus delayed. They call that the misery index, which is hilarious. Overall, Flight Aware is an incredibly useful tool and one that I highly recommend for the traveler that needs to be in the know. If you wanna know what other travel apps you need for an upcoming trip, check out this video right here. And if you enjoyed this step-by-step -step tutorial, check out this one I made on how to book cheap flights with Google Flights. Subscribe for more. Thanks so much for watching. Happy travels.